Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, dudes, we're going to talk about something really, really awesome, but it's just been released in GTA 5, guys. So, further ado, let's get into today's video, dudes. So, before we get started, make sure to subscribe, give a like, guys, and further ado, let's get on with it. So, the thing what I want to talk about is the new vehicle that has just been released in GTA Online. So, yeah, there's been a new vehicle, uh, new vehicle in GTA Online, guys, which is pretty cool. And this vehicle is right here. If you go on here, guys, and you want to go on to Southern San Andreas, which is here. So this vehicle is actually called the uh, Bugatti Escalier. So this is about 2,600 and 400, right, two, yeah, 2,064,000. Uh, uh, for that, which is uh, pretty expensive if you think about it, because the latest vehicle what we had was here, and obviously that was two million, and that was ridic That's a ridiculous amount of money. It's unbelievable. You can see on the top there, it's ridiculous. I didn't want to buy that. Uh, yeah, but we're gonna buy this vehicle today. Uh, you can see that we got this came out. So that Scooby Doo Yoga Van will come out next week, I think. I can't wait for that vehicle, but let's actually check this vehicle out because this look this vehicle looks pretty pretty cool. So let's make sure check this out, see what it's like, and customize this vehicle right. if we can because it looks pretty cool. So there we go. We just got it, guys. So wait for it to deliver. It looks pretty cool. I've got me. I'm even gonna. I'm even joking. It looks pretty pretty cool, and I cannot wait to check this vehicle out and see what it's actually specifically like. So you can hear all my vehicles here. Got the uh, intervention, uh, uh, blah, 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 blah. the zombie bobber, uh, the Manchez, which is the Manchez is quite fast. The uh, couple of name now, the quad bike, and this vehicle here, which I think is the Hexer. So we've got all these vehicles here. Pretty cool. So yeah, there's quite a few vehicles here that you may want to check out, guys, which is pretty cool. So uh, let's wait for the vehicle to deliver. Uh, da, da, da. So it should be here. We'll customize it, and everything, guys. See what it's like. See if it's cool. Uh, a Q and A video will come out very, very shortly, guys. Uh, make sure to check that out, guys. You're gonna see that. There it is. Boom, here it is. So here it is. Now the speed on it looks really, really cool. Faster than the Manchez and faster than the other vehicles. Uh, it's not the fastest bike though, but uh, it's the fastest dirt bike I would say. Okay, the way it looks. Okay, the way it looks is pretty cool. To me, it looks like a scooter, but you can actually upgrade that to make it a little bit more better. You can actually see here. And yeah, this is a pretty good vehicle. Now I heard this is a classic video, uh, classic vehicle, and I'm not really sure what that means. If, it, if you look at the description, it might tell you what it means by classic. It might not mean anything. That's just a description of the vehicle. And you can do wheelies, which is actually really, really good. I like bikes what can do wheelies. Oop, I'm on the wrong way. So yeah, I like bikes what can do wheelies and stuff like that. And this vehicle looks pretty cool itself. I mean, it looks awesome. I mean, there's nothing really interested about this vehicle it, it just looks really really nice of a vehicle uh, you can see the light is pretty cool but I just want to upgrade it because it might look better when you upgrade it but this vehicle isn't too bad I've got it it isn't really too that bad but uh, I can't wait for the yoga van uh, next week 
that is the lastest vehicle of what is actually the Civic E coming out. So, yeah, we're going to just keep, keep making more vehicles, but uh, that's the last of the bikers. Uh, of these vehicles. I wanted this slab banner to come in, but the slab banner isn't really going to come in. It might come in for our next update, but I don't really know. So you can see, look at it. We've only got about 12k, so we haven't really got a lot. To sell it for 15k, it's not worth it. So you can do bodywork, so this is where you can change stuff now. So you can change the uh, covers to make it look like a dirt bike or something like that. But uh, yeah, you can do all this to make it look cool. I will keep this on though, but it's up to you. We can remove the headlights uh, if you so want to. I might do that. Also, you can just get rid of these, remove the mud guards and stuff to make it look like a really, really cool bike. Uh, I might do that as well. The seats you can change. Uh, Off-road seat. I think we're just going to keep that seat as it is. Change the mirrors on it, which look pretty cool on the back. I've got on it. Uh, fuel tanks. You can change the fuel tanks if you so want to. Uh, you don't really have to. I mean, it's not, there's nothing really thinking about that, but uh, you can change all this. If you really want to, you can just change it and it looks pretty, pretty cool if you change that. Uh, the engine you can still operate, you can tune it. They, they, they do cost a lot of money, the exhaust you can actually operate. I would go for this one because it makes a, it's a cheaper of a version of it. The holes you can change, the lights you can change to Xeno, but I don't really go for Xeno. Livery, so this is where things are getting interesting now. So the liveries, they look awesome. I mean, this looks pretty cool. Uh, the flames are pretty cool on this. So the black, there's the black and red, the classic yellow, don't really match all of that. The blue, the blue looks pretty cool on it. Uh, I might go for the blue. The blue looks pretty, pretty, pretty cool. The blue light stripe it looks pretty awesome in this vehicle. The yellow looks pretty cool. Is there a blue one of these? Yes, there is. The blue retro version of it. So that looks pretty cool. Uh, what else is there? That looks pretty awesome. The flames look pretty cool on this though, I mean, I've got to admit, the flames look awesome. So I'm going to get that. But the livery is going to be changed though. So I think, not the livery, the uh, respray. So I'm going to put my crew emblem on. But I don't know if I want to change the colour of it. Uh, black, I think, matches well with it, I think, really. Uh, it just looks awesome. But we can keep, you can change it if you want to. It's up to you. Uh, yeah, you can just change the colours. Maybe ice white, which is pretty cool. But I might just go for this one, and uh, they can change the secondary colour if you want to, to make it look awesome. What I might do is make it orange, because orange matches well. Uh, so if you want to do orange, you can do orange livery. Bright orange you can do. Uh, red you can do, if you... You like red and stuff, Torino red. So you can do red. It looks pretty, pretty cool. The black and red looks awesome on it. Uh, you can do that. Or you can just keep it. Or, like I was saying, you can change it black. And all the way down. So you can just change the black. You know, black, it's pretty cool. You know, it's. And just keep it like that. It's up to really you what you basically want to do. You can do the transmissions. But I think I'm done with it. It, it looks pretty cool so far. So let's check this vehicle out and the way its speed is. So you can actually check the way it looks. And to be honest with you, it is fast. Uh, it is a pretty cool vehicle though. And honestly, the way it looks is pretty, pretty, pretty cool. It isn't a bad of a vehicle. I've got to admit, it is a really good vehicle to use. Uh, it's not the best bike that I've seen, but to be honest with you, I might keep this vehicle because actually this vehicle might be useful in some hands. Uh, this vehicle isn't really that bad. It's pretty, pretty cool. So make sure to check this vehicle out, guys, if you want to check it out. It isn't a bad of a vehicle, guys. I mean, it's not the best vehicle what I've seen because there's other vehicles that I think are just amazing. Like the Chitara, for example, which is a lot of money and I can't really afford that yet. But uh, there is other vehicles there that you may want to get. So this one is pretty, pretty cool. Uh, 
So yeah, this is pretty, pretty cool of a vehicle. I mean, I'm really impressed with this. This is actually a really nice vehicle that I actually have. The livery on it is pretty, pretty cool. Like, the flames are light on it. Uh, I've really got a vehicle that has got flames. But I like flames on these vehicles because they actually make it look awesome. Yeah! So guys, make sure to subscribe, give a like. And guys, if you like this vehicle, make sure to check it out. Because this vehicle isn't really that bad. I mean, it is only about 26k, so... 20k so it's still a lot guys i mean it's 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 a cheap bike though i comment it is a cheap bike but it's the uh customization will take a lot of money off you guys so there is guys boom all my vehicles here ready uh here's the other one i've got flames on pretty cool it's not as big as this but this one's nice guys so make sure to subscribe guys give a like a q a video will come soon the announcement when it's going to be and stuff guys so make sure to check that out guys please subscribe Please click that blue thumbs up, click that red button, guys. I'm gonna see more GTA 5 videos and more latest videos, guys. And I'm out. Beaver, out.